In case you missed it, it's a great segment for me because I miss virtually everything. <laughs> right over my head. Serena Morales here to, to set us straight. I got you, David. I got uh, you, Linda. Yeah. Here's the deal. Yeah, because there's so many things that, you know, we, we kind of miss. So we need you, Serena, to educate and entertain us. I got Go. you both. I got you both, by the way. Um, okay. As we get ready to crown another NBA champion, one wonders, what are the characteristics of an NBA champion? Raw drive, talent, determination? Sure. But apparently, it also doesn't ha doesn't hurt to have been once a teammate of Shaquille O'Neal. Our very own Jackie McC McMullen explains why. With so get this: the only championship team over the last three decades missing from Shaq's list. Yep. The 2011 Dallas Mavericks, and it's a shame because Sasha Pavlovich, Shaq's former Celtics teammate, he was sort of on the squad, but he was released before the playoffs. What so, can we say? So officially, he doesn't have that one on his foot, but he's got every way. He's well-traveled, obviously, Shaq is, and he hung out with a lot of championship players. Yeah. Well, Serena, thanks for stopping Thank in. Thank you very much. All right. All right. That's a run and go. Give it up. <laughs> Three stars in these finals. You got LeBron, Curry, and Clay. I always feel a little judgmental, but that's okay. Mm. We've got our confidence in the Warriors and Cavs, their supporting cast. Mm. Oh, Max, yeah, I believe you're in charge today. Okay. This bad boy. That's the way it should be. All right, so we'll start with J.R. Smith. <laughs> him tonight. I think LeBron's going to get him good looks, and he has shown in the past uh, there's no one else in the but Let's start him right here. He can go off and have a big game. Start. Yeah, well, it's a tough matchup in the finals got Clay Thompson, so when you're, you're over there trying to get... It's amazing. It's really, it's really tough to criticize Blatt when they just run the game on the road. How do you criticize him? J uh, certainly ahead yeah, of JR. I some of that. I some the of that. only reason I won't put him ahead of Green is because Coach doesn't play him in the fourth quarter. I mean, you know... <laughs> He's not on the floor. It's not his fault. What can he do from the bench? When aggressive with his size, that's a miss. Certainly better than J.R. Smith. His defense on LeBron, particularly in the first game, was ridiculous because no one could stop LeBron except for Iguodala. Whoa. I'm going to move him ahead of Mozgov. And let's not forget that this guy, Delhi, he just shut down the MVP. He shut him down. Let, let's say what it is. And they won as a result. And this is not the first great game he's put ahead of Iguodala. He's a better player than Della Vadova. And Green also, again, the reason he's being considered for a max contract is because if he's not a star, he's the next thing. And this dude is seven feet tall and, and, can, and can guard Iguodala. But Della Vadova's got more value than J.R. Smith. That's what it is. This is interesting. This is like the guy we're all talking about. He ain't going to shut down Steph Curry. Never, not in his dreams. Yeah. And he just did. Yeah, the most valuable asset you can have for your team is if you can st shut down their best player. The yeah. index is all I about, Max. You, you did it right. That's right. Uh, yeah, you did it wrong, Nation. Yeah, you did it wrong, Shame Nation. on you. Coming up. All right. This can't be real. Colin Kaepernick could be on the trading block. Mm. 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 We will discuss it, but first, a little Jimmy Fallon. Hello. In with us. Uh, you know a thing about signing a, a rather large quarterback to a big deal. Um, so when you sort of start dealing with these negotiations, what are the tenants to keep in mind going in? Well, one thing you have to keep in mind, no matter how aggressive the agent... ...need money for these particular quarterbacks, and we'll put them in order here. Uh, notably, there's a 2A and a 2B, uh, so we're not 1, 2, 3, 4, not in Bill Polian's mind. Uh, start us off with number three. Well, number three is going to be Philip Rivers. And here's the issue with Philip. He's an Iron Man. He played. We all knew this was going to be. And the there he is. Okay, this is the guy that does everything. He can run. Take up a huge, huge, huge piece. He, of the here's pie. what I wonder because you say sky's limit for Andrew Luck. Uh, Russell Wilson, you have some things you have to look out for in terms yes. of injury, durability, so on and so yes. forth. What's the discrepancy, guaranteed money wise, between one and two? Well, the agents are going to ask for 